and welcome to Lake Street News. I'm Zach. And I'm Lily. Tonight we've got stories about hot dogs, Dr. Brown, a car chase, and more. <laughs> Breaking news, the world famous Oscar Mayer Wienermobile visited Ithaca last Thursday. Attendees to the quote unquote meet up reported that the event was buns of fun. And many attendees bought Wienermobilia from inside of the van. The superb sausage sedan will make its long anticipated trip to Binghamton after leaving Ithaca. Dr. Brown recently outlined his priorities for the 2024 school year. The superintendent plans to seek authorization for a budget up to $125 million over the next 10 years. The budget addresses several needs, including moving from gas to electric buses and other maintenance work on bathrooms, roofs, and playgrounds. Brown said that there is a, quote, significant amount of infrastructure upgrades that need to take place, not with just Ju not just within our school district, but within our community." Unquote. This just in, Tompkins County's EMS Rapid Response Pilot Program will be funded almost entirely by a state grant following an unexpected influx of more than unexpected $500,000 in, in unexpected funding. Initially, the county applied for only $70,000. We're thrilled about this funding, County Administrator Lisa Holmes said. There's been a widespread support for the program and the need for it to support our volunteer municipal ambulance services. Over in Newfield, there's some crazy stuff going on. On January 20th, Austin Leah from Willysville was pulled over for a traffic violation in Aaron, but he fled, starting a four-county-wide chase ending in Newfield. Upon being caught, he was found with a loaded AK-47 and 7.5 and grams of meth. Austin has been sent to Shimon County Jail until either he pays $200,000 or someone else pays double that. Thank you for watching Lake Street News. Hey, I'm supposed to say that. Whatever. And have a great day. Well. Uh, yeah, that was interesting. So, that car chase, right? That car chase was very intense. Yes. Just like the circus fire on Thursday, it was intense. Well, yeah. how interesting.